Stuffing instead of potatoes, honey, I love you. Meat is murder, Frank. Speaking of conserving waste, just because your British pop sensation's career has gone stale doesn't mean that he has to. That's why we've invented the Tupperware container to lock in pop star freshness. Who's our stale singing sensation, Frank? Well, it's none other than British pop star Morrissey. <laughs> He's a little depressed. <laughs> so, Morrissey, uh, how you doing? He hurt me with that remark. Did I mention that I cried? <laughs> well, I mean, come on, Marcy. I mean, uh, we're basically evil, granted, but uh, a lot of what we say around here is just good-natured ribbon. Well, it hurt me. Did I mention that I cried? Is it wrong not to always be glad? Well, we seem to have got you at a bad time. Uh, like uh, Morrissey, Joel, your experiment this week comes from that shameful decade known as the 80s. Uh, it's a film called City Limits, and it stars James Earl Jones at the low point in his career and Kim Cattrall at a high point. Uh, it also has Robbie Benson and Ray Dong Chong doing things they're not happy with either. And now, to prove that our Tupperware coffin really locks in pop star freshness, Morrissey's going to honor us with a song, aren't you, Morrissey? This is a song I wrote at a time in my life when I was very, very, very sad. At breakfast, actually. It's called Hairdresser in a Coma. I cried last night, I died a million deaths Thinking of your sweet face And the way you sing I cried inside, we lied and died And then I cried again I must have wept for hours Cause I couldn't